Good morning, guys. Yo. And happy Thursday. Um, we're currently stuck in traffic. John has got the day off work today. Um, he's driving me to work. I start work at nine. It's 8.52. The traffic is moving very slowly. Um, but yes, pink is uh, fading into the nice candy floss color that I like. And that is kind of update of our day. The oven is being fixed today. Whoop whoop. John has sorted it out. He's got contractor come in. Save the day. Because uh, my cooking skills, my cooking skills are all right, but it's rather limited when you haven't got a full oven. So that's quite exciting. Um, and yeah, that is what is happening. Stuck in traffic. So I'm home. I'm uh, just quickly got changed into some work clothes, not work clothes, like at home, not doing a lot. That's rubbish. I've got changed into some casual clothes because, yeah, I'm just going to do some stuff at home and tidy up and get the, give the oven a quick clean out before the uh, thingy man comes. Um, so, yeah, fingers crossed. He can fix the oven. I went to sleep on the sofa. And Gilly sat watching me tidy up. Tidying up. Done. Now we wait for the oven man to come. Should be here any time. Oven man's been fixed. Yay! Um, guy called Chris, really nice bloke. Brought his, I think it was his son. Someone's probably about my age, but they work together, doing, you know, this was a little repair, but obviously they do a lot of other stuff, so they're working as a pair. But yeah, cool, nice blokes, both played with Darwin and Gilly a bit, and uh, yeah, it's all good, oven's fixed, and a two-year guarantee. Now I'm going to sit down with a brew and watch this. Draft days with Kevin Costner, Moneyball meets transfer deadline day. So yeah, I'm gonna watch this. I've been dying to watch this for ages. Apparently it's been on Netflix, but I've not got Netflix. But uh Katie bought me the DVD from Amazon. Happy days. Yo, so watch draft days, good film. Enjoyed that. It's pretty short though, it's only just about hour and a half. Seems as though it was gonna I thought it was gonna go on a bit longer than it did, but anyway. Um yeah, good film that was. Um now off to pick Katie up. I'm not gonna lie, I did fall asleep. Um, it's been pretty full on since we got back from got back since we got back from Poland. And uh, it's just my sort of like first day off at home on my own, like my normal chill out Thursdays. So it's been about four Thursdays on the bounce so I've been working. So yeah. I've worked a month for Thursdays. And uh, yeah, anyway, I'll just, you know, check my notes off now. It's been good. Uh, what the heck is that? It's on the side of the road with some horses and like a big shark kind of thing. Trap. Call it trap. Call me in trap. I don't know, something like that. Anyway, <coughs> yeah, it's good. Anyway, I'm going to go and pick Katie up now. It's just gone 20 past 7, 20 past 7, so I'm still half asleep, 1700 hours, 20 past 5. Um, I'll see you in a bit. Hi guys. Yo. And it is home time. It is 8 minutes past 6. We are almost home. And yes, I have had an okay day at work. Not marvellous, but not horrendous. It was okay. Um, I did nip to Marks and Spencer's uh, on my lunch break. Uh, I will show you what I purchased. Uh, basically, it was to make up for the failings that we had at the weekend. Yeah. Now we've got an oven that actually heats up. Yeah, now we've got an oven that works. Oh my god. Um, I also I got this tari beef teriyaki sushi thing, which I have eaten. Um, what? What? What did you have? It was like beef, beef teriyaki. Beef teriyaki. Teriyaki. 
sushi roll, but obviously there was no sushi in it because it was beef. It was like a little snack pot. It was like three little rolls, and it was like one pound eighty. One pound twenty, one pound eighty, and it only had like ninety calories in it. Oh, that's even better. No, because you would have needed a good twelve packs to actually feel full. Um, but it tasted nice. Sounds good. So that's what I also had, but I've eaten that, so you can't see it. But yeah, I will show you the, what I did purchase when we get home. So from Marks and Spencers, we got another tub of salted caramel popcorn mini bites. Yep, may have opened them up in the car on the way home because they're amazing. Uh, rosemary roast potatoes, again, yummy. Cheeky little uh, vegetable medley, medley, it's like peas and broccoli and courgette. And then there for my handbag, some sugar free rhubarb and custard drops. Potatoes in the oven. I am back in my fabulous Primani jammies. By Q, there's Darwin George. You beautiful. Both boys seem really tired. I think the guys that came to fix the fix the cooker or oven really worn them out. John says one of the younger guy kept on playing with them, and both boys are pooped. You know, fixing the oven and doggy daycare. You know, what more can you ask for? Uh, yeah. So, potatoes in the oven. House is very neat and tidy. John's obviously done a lot of hiding today and um i think we're gonna are we carrying on with game of thrones mm. carrying on with game of thrones john is looking at holidays because that's his favorite thing um yeah i'm starving though i can't wait for this tea to be ready and it's tea time and my oven is working um we have got lamb steaks and we've got rosemary roast potatoes or chipped potatoes from Marks and Sparks and then um, a veg medley, uh, peas, broccoli and courgette and then red cabbage, yum! So this one's mine and this one's John's. Tea done, now time for Game of Thrones. Hey guys. Yo. And that is bedtime and been rather crummy vloggers John has been looking at holidays. I have done an emergency uh, food order. Shopping normally comes on a Saturday, but I'm going out on Saturday. So I'm having it come Friday. I'd like to point out it's Thursday night. So finally finalised said shopping, went to check out and half my trolley was out of stock, which is so annoying. But anyway, sorted it. We also ate uh, Birdle chocolate. Mm. It's really good. If you are good to Poland, or you ever get the opportunity to eat federal chocolate, it's amazing. But yeah, I'm going to go to bed. Hope you've had a good day. And we'll see you soon. Bye, guys. Night.